I didn't know that I needed some Choo Choo Survivor lore, but we are going to read some Choo Choo Survivor lore right here on the Steam page for the game. We have ChatGPT story versus the dev story for Choo Choo Survivor. Let's go through this. I have not read any of this, so this this might be really funny. Let's let's see what ChatGPT came up with for Choo Choo Survivor. The dev said, some people have been asking for more story for Choo Choo Survivor. As a solo indie dev, my time is scarce. So I've chosen to allocate my time towards making the game mechanics more fun. Fair enough. And developing better meta progression. Therefore, I outsource the story to Chat GPT. And you can compare its story versus my story below. All right, so let's get into this. Chat GPT story, Choo Choo Survivor story. In the desolate world of Choo Choo Survivor, an unimaginable catastrophe has befallen humanity. A lethal virus outbreak has turned people into ravenous zombies, leaving only a handful of survivors scattered across the remnants of civilization. Amidst the chaos, a brave train conductor named Alex emerges as a beacon of hope. Alex, interesting, so we have a name for our train conductor. Alex finds himself in control of the last functional train, a relic from a bygone era. Determined to save as many survivors as possible, he embarks on a perilous journey to guide the train to safety. The mission is clear. Steer the train through treacherous terrain and endless hordes of undead, seeking refuge in a distant sanctuary. This doesn't sound too far off from the game. As Alex drives the train forward, he witnesses the grim reality of the world around him. Crumbling cities, overgrown forests, desolate wastelands serve as haunting reminders of the once vibrant life that thrived. The tracks stretch out endlessly before him, fraught with obstacles and dangers at every turn. Accompanying Alex are a courageous group of survivors, each with their own unique skills and stories. Together they form a makeshift family, united by a shared will to survive. As the train hurdles forward, they must work together, defending against relentless zombie attacks and ensuring the safety of their fellow passengers. With each passing day, the zombie hordes grow larger and more ferocious. Their hunger for human flesh is insatiable. And they relentlessly pursue the train, clawing, gnashing at its metallic shell. Alex and the survivors must utilize their limited resources wisely, scavenging for supplies and making difficult decisions to sustain their journey. Along the way, they encounter remnants of a crumbling society, shattered remnants of hope and despair. Survivors in need of aid, abandoned shelters, and cryptic messages all contribute to the mystery surrounding the origins of the outbreak. Alex and his comrades strive to uncover the truth, believing that knowledge holds the key to humanity's salvation. This is deep. As they press on, the train becomes a fortress on wheels. That is true. Retrofitted with defensive measures to repel the undead, makeshift barricades, reinforced plating, and ingenious contraptions provide temporary respite in the face of relentless attacks. Yet the battle for survival intensifies with each passing mile. Through unwavering determination and sacrifice, Alex and his companions navigate through a nightmarish landscape inching closer to their destination. The train whistles, or whistle pierces the desolate silence, echoing a call of resilience and defiance. They are survivors, a flickering flame in a world consumed by darkness. You know what, ChatGPT did pretty good there. Pretty good. I would say, you know, I would... That sounds like something I would actually enjoy reading, kind of, you know? It's a little bit of Walking Dead in there. Uh, let, let's go. Well, Walking Dead with a train. I don't think there's any trains in that. Let's go on to the Dev's Choo Choo story. All right. So, zombies are everywhere. A locomotive seems like a great idea to get from A to B. Okay, let's drive the loco. <laughs> okay, there are too many zombies. Bring out the guns. Boom, boom, bang, bang. Train gets to safety. Hooray! That was actually fun. Let's do it again. 
I like it. I like it a lot. You know what? I'm glad that the dev is sticking to their strong suit and working on the game itself and not the lore because, oh, it speaks for itself. Let's just let ChatGPT write the lore. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed me reading the lore for the game. I'll catch you on the next one. Have a fantastic day.